Hi guys, it's Shani from Yanomize and welcome back to T-Way, this week at Yanomize, episode 14. If you haven't subscribed to the Yanomize YouTube channel, hit that button now and make sure you turn on the bell icon so you know when we've uploaded. So first up, Bert's car. He always takes this slot, he loves it there. Um, he needs to learn to clean his car a little bit. But anyway, you've seen that every week. Let's go inside. So the first car you see when we walk in is my brand new Porsche Taycan Turbo S. I picked this up the other day and um, yeah, really, really happy with her. She's an amazing car. Make sure you guys click here. You need to see that collection video. It's, um, it's insane. But yeah, that is my fully electric car. Yes, Yanni went electric. In the old unit, we've got this BMW X4M competition going matte metallic charcoal. Um, three panels have been laid this side and I think one on that side. It's a great car. It's got a fantastic, fantastic interior. Um, BMW fanboys, I know you love this one. So in bay two, we've got this Bentley Bentayga. Um, the customer decided to do it two tones. So the top half in one color, the bottom half in another. This really, really works. The purple is actually a nose tick, but I think, I think this is so cool. I don't really see um, many Bentley Bentaygas done in the two-tone top and bottom, but what do you think? Do you think this works? I personally think it does. I think the bonnet and the wings look great. And obviously when you run down to the rear quarter, you can see obviously the, um, the switch of the colors. So yeah, this Bentley Bentayga, two-tone, gorgeous. It's actually very, very quiet over here. I think Nico and Mark are just, they're just concentrating on the wing mirrors. Wing mirrors are not easy to wrap, um, as you can see. And they're white as well, so they've got to hide everything. Mark? Nico? You know, when, when you're that level, everything's easy, but it's not easy. Bentley Bentayga um, is being fitted, but as you can see, the boot lid still hasn't been done yet. Pav's working on the arch over this side. Pav, all Damn good? Well, this is good. Boot lid is a nightmare, but we'll get there. Mark and Nico. They're wrapping, they're good. Mark and Nico, show, Mark and Nico. Show them a new toe. He's got a new toe. Work in progress. We're gonna do a big piece here. Shush, shush, we, don't, we don't want to see the hair, bro. We just want to see the toe. Got delicious, man. I'm green. You're green. This way. Why don't you turn it around? There you go. Look at that. Scabby. That's it. it needs a bit of cream. Bit of cream. All right. Let's go into the back seat. Sal. Oh, Doing the back. It's Sal. He's always on his own. We just get the violins out for him. Sal likes working on his own. He likes silence. He likes quiet. And when you do PPF, it's a little bit different to rapping. So um, I think you need a bit more concentration. Sal, do you like working on your own? Love it. <laughs> he loves it, he loves it. Uh, BMW M8 competition, having paint protection film. It's a great, great color. Obviously that is why the customer is not wrapping it. But yeah, there's gonna be more coming on this car. It's got carbon everywhere. So before I head over there, let's have a quick catch up with some of the cars that arrived last week that are not actually here this week. So first up, we've got this unbelievable Ferrari piece, the Spider. So this car is coming for a full PPF and you can't blame the customer because look at the colour. Why would you want to change it? So it's Friday at Yanomai's and I've just got to work. Um, Hi, um, and we've had a brand new car turn up. This one belongs to Gina. Uh, Gina's work wife, office manager, EA, uh, who's upstairs. Her brand spanking new car from BMW Park Lane. Yes, I say BMW, it is BMW Mini. Uh, Park Lane, we work really closely with them. And she's got a lovely new Mini that's like a Nardo grey colour. It's got Recaro seats. It's colour coded everywhere, gloss black wheels. It's got the John Cooper Works um, bits as well. Nice. She's excited. Um, I said we'd have to go for a drive in it because she's a bit nervous to drive it the first day. But she's like, I don't want it filmed. So anyway, we're showing you the car and I'll take her for a drive later. So when I picked up my car, I was like, anything less than 40 miles, I'm happy with. I think mine was 36. This has only got eight. I feel cheated. I feel like my car's like second hand now at 36. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. This car actually coming to us last night. Uh, the customer actually picked it up yesterday afternoon and brought it directly to us for a ghost. Um, he wanted to get it protected. 
uh, and that's what we're gonna do. So here's my Lamborghini Urus. You might be thinking, why is that in the workshop? The reason the bonnet's open is I'll wrap the bonnet in something brand new. We're testing something out and if it works, oh my God, this car's gonna be insane. And um, yeah, you might see it next week or the week after. I just need to try and squeeze it in somehow. But yeah, the bonnet has something laid on it, um, but you'll see it very, very soon. But there's my Lamborghini Urus, Nero design, carbon everywhere, 24 inch wheels. If you haven't seen me click this one, you can click here and see that collection from Lamborghini HR Rowing. Chrome Red SLS is still here. It's been here a little while now, but we have to prioritize some other cars. MVSL, they always bring us cars and they were happy to say, don't worry, Yanni, we're not in a rush for it. It's still got front and rear bumpers to be done. It's got the shuts and returns to be done in gloss black and then it will be complete. But um, yeah, that's one of their cars there. And then behind, we've got another one of their cars. So here's the second one of MVSL's uh, cars. This is the XKRS in satin pearl white. I do like a white car. Uh, we don't really do many white cars. I think the trend has stopped, but I think it still looks great. Rather than just a gloss white, he wanted something that's got a bit more of a sheen to it. It is cool. He's breaking it up with the gloss black mirrors um, and certain elements like the carbon spoiler, the vents. But this, this is cool. This, this is a really, really nice kind. I think this will look great when it's finished. There's even carbon inside the engine bay. Last panel to be done is the back bumper. So you've got Daniel, who everyone knows is a rapper, uh, the one from, where are you from? New Zealand. From New Zealand. Obviously we had some fun with him last week. And we've got Kieran. Kieran is actually a junior, or was a junior at Yanomai. He's been here quite a few years now. He's now rapping. Um, so progression has been fantastic. And he's rapping a bumper. So um, Kieran and Daniel finishing off the Jag. The Audi A5 has just come in. Um, it's gloss black going to like an ice gray. It's up in it, it's having wheels, it's having the full wrap. You've got Rio in the back. Rio as well was a junior and he's now stepped up and he now strips and fits cars. All good, Rio? Obviously hasn't gone to his head. Um, but yeah, this car's just arrived. You'll see more of this next week once we start wrapping it. And obviously behind me, there's a manager. He spends all his time on the phone. Hi, Terry. Checking job cards, job cards on his phone. Center caps, grills, badges. Going gloss black. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. So we're at the back of the unit. You might not have seen this last week. They put a fence up. This is obviously to stop us from going over that side. Um, I think they're setting up a car wash here or something. So they put this fence because when people drive around, I don't really want people to be able to see my customers' cars. We are going to paint this because it looks, looks like a back garden. Um, yeah, I would have rather not a fence, but it is what it is anyway. Model X P100D Tesla. Um, this car is a previous customer. He's also got another Tesla that we've wrapped. They're both having kits. So this car here is for a full wrap and having a body kit. Um, the kit arrived this week. So there'll be more on this. There'll be loads more on this car next week. But for now, there it is sitting there dirty. She needs a wash. And the final car is this Ford Fiesta ST um, by EBC Brakes. Um, they're turning into something real, real cool. It's gonna go satin black with red, it's gonna have logos and a design on it. I'm excited for this, but yeah, that is their car. It's got a fantastic interior as well. I do like these, where are my Ford fans? Who, like, who likes a lovely Ford? Ford ST, Fiesta, full wrap, full design, full change. So that is it guys, this week at Yanomise. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed to see all the cars that were here, including my two new cars, my Porsche Taycan Turbo S behind me, and obviously my Urus over there. If you click here, you can obviously see those videos on the Animize YouTube channel. But again, thank you so much, and I'll see you soon. Take care.